Among the 6,845 men, women, and children who set off in the Boston Marathon yesterday, two were pursuing special goals. Bill Rogers, the local hero, was trying to win the race for the fifth time and was trying to become the first person ever to win it four years in a row. But Rogers' goals were nothing compared to Johnny Kelly's. Kelly, the local superhero, was simply out to finish in his 50th appearance in the Boston Marathon. Kelly, who won the race twice in 1935 and 1945, achieved his goal. Four hours and one minute after the start, he made his way to the finish line, completing the 26-mile, 385-yard course in only an hour and a half longer than he took when he won his first victory at the age of 27. He did much worse in his first Boston Marathon in 1928, when at the age of 20, he failed to finish. I feel it's one of the happiest days of my life. Outside of the uh, two victories I had many, many, many years ago, uh, I love this one more so than ever before. Bill Rogers, however, failed to achieve his goal. He came in third. The winner was Toshihiko Seiko of Japan, who set a new record for the race. The first woman to finish was a New Zealander, Alison Rowe, who also set a record for women in the race. Bill Rogers says he'll try again next year. Johnny Kelly says he will, too. Dick Schaap, ABC News, Boston.